Hi, my name is Salvatore Candela, and I'm a support engineer here at New Relic. Today, we'll be running through a quick install of New Relic Serverless for AWS Lambda, which will let you see detailed instrumented data for your functions. There are a few ways of setting this up. Today, we're going to use our new CLI tool, which has some pretty cool functions to it. So right now, in the video, we're poking around in the UI. We have our basic hello world function, a couple of basic invocations showing up in New Relic, but we don't have any super detailed data yet. So uh, we're going to start off by listing the functions in our AWS account and seeing which things have stuff installed. Currently in this one, nothing does. So what we're going to do is we're going to take that wow so lambda function and we're going to install the layer to it. And what we're going to do is we're going to use the new relic lambda layers install command with a couple arguments. And that's going to just take care of installing the layer, the handler, and the environment variables to the function. So now when we run this, we just punch in our function name and our account ID, wait for it to do its magic. And we got some magic sparkles. Now, we're gonna check the function out. We got a layer installed, which has the latest version of the New Relic node agent. And we have some cool things like the New Relic Lambda wrapper handler and some environment variables set. So this does all the config you need to send your stuff up to the log ingest function. It's not gonna show up in New Relic just yet, but we can see we're making a payload and that has all of your instrumented goodness. So up here, we're in New Relic and we are gonna refresh and we still see we're not quite getting all that data yet. So that leaves us with one more step and that's to set up the log ingest function. Luckily, we have another command that does just that and that's gonna be New Relic Lambda subscriptions install. So after this completes, it's going to be subscribed to the ingest function and sending your payloads up to New Relic. And magic sparkles. All right, we should be all set to go. We're going to run a couple more test invocations and then do a little movie magic to uh, save you the minute or two that would take to show up in New Relic 1. So here we go. We have our detailed invocation data and we would see things like cold start and error rate, if there were any cold starts or errors. And we can actually go into see our detailed invocation data now for each one. And from there we can drill into cool stuff like error traces, invocation breakdowns, and logs and context. So uh, yeah. There we have it, everything is all hooked up now and the uh, CLI makes it pretty dang easy. So thanks for watching everybody.